Today we're giving you 12 tricks that can save your life in 2012. And Dr. Lisa and I have some questions we recently received from you viewers at home. And the first one came to us via Twitter from Dees8 Nove, I think that's how you pronounce it, who tweets, <laughs> if I go into premature labor, is there anything I can do to keep my baby safe? Uh, the first thing you have to do is call your doctor because a lot of things we can if we can hear in the woman's voice you know heavy breathing and things like that sometimes we can tell you to go straight to labor and delivery other times we can walk you through things that you may be able to do like getting off your feet taking that pressure of the uterus off of the cervix that can help and these are things that are going to alleviate or help in the meantime we may ask you know you to go to the, the labor because there are things that actually precipitate premature labor like infections and we'd want to get you checked out for that. But laying down, again, getting that pressure off the uterus, drinking water. You may say have a glass of water because you may have been running around and gotten dehydrated. And what happens when you get dehydrated is the levels of oxytocin increase in your blood. So this increases your blood volume, decreases, decreases that level of oxytocin, which can cause contractions. Good stuff. Thanks, Dr. Lisa. Yeah.